Can a brother get his head out? Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> I forgot about you. That's like something feels <laughs> off. We in here, bruh. We back, man. Yeah, we ain't dead. Took a little bit off, but we back, bro. Here we go again. We back, man. Shout out to Margaret Mendoza for requesting that we watch this. Nothing like sequel. Nigga, watch it. If I was a multimillionaire, you would not catch me hunting in these forests no more. After killing children, huh? I was a mega fan of these books back in uh, middle school and high school. Noob didn't know how to read until the age of uh, 21. So I uh, he had to, I had to give him the audiobooks to this series. That's an exaggeration. It's 24. Just <laughs> <laughs> learn how to read this year? <laughs> I've been winging it. Nigga has a post-traumatic stress. You killed like two people in the entire Hunger Games. White people are really traumatized by like deaths and stuff, man. Black people can bounce back quick, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Nigga. <laughs> I remember my first body at the age of like six, just uh, in the snow. I was like, that's a body for you. Hey, Mitch. Nigga, too busy being Woody Harrelson. You know, he's like having a great time because he gets to wear a headpiece. Well, you think he's balding? You know, like shortly after this. <laughs> you know, very shortly after this. That's a really good wig he has on. It is. You saw how it jiggled and bounced like real hair. I heard they're releasing a book about like the backstory of President Snow, and people were hating on it, but I re President Snow is a really good character, man. But here you are. I expect you can guess where he is. Yes, I think so. He's at the candy store. I left him there. If I was Katniss, I'd have to strangle him right now. I want us to be friends. I got enough friends, bro. I got enough friends! If I be seeing you like on online, and it's just this old white guy. He's my friend. <laughs> it's my best friend. I would kill him. There is literally nobody here. Jump on his neck right now. Did he he's dropping? Gale being a player, bro. Snow just causing he just had to play the clip of that. He's like, like he's like, hey, I'm here to cause toxicity. These niggas look like extras in a panic at the disco music video. Back to the streets where we began. I haven't seen this guy in a movie in a long time. This was the last movie I ever- Whoa! Slipping into some sinful natures, bro. I would not be doing this for T- I've already won the Hunger Games. The act is over. I'm putting on a, a wife beater and Jenko jeans and calling it a day, dude. Things are, uh, things are great here in 12. I hit it. Never been closer. And I hit it. And he got me on a counter. It was me. Yeah. Stop it. Stop being a simp. Hunger Games is really the simp games, really. The simp games. Niggas die. You pour one out, and you thug it out, bro. <laughs> Dude, like, no. I bake. I'm a baker. I throw bread at people. <laughs> if, it, if it was a Hunger Games fighting, like, fighter, oh, God. Peter would have a bread-throwing move. Ha! 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 Here are the speeches. The speech just says, I'm so Holly Grove, New Orleans. I'm so Holly Grove, New Orleans. Lil Weezy Anna. Home sweet, home deep. To donate one month of our winnings. I'd be like, sorry for your loss, but this money's mine, nigga. Oh, nigga just did a hand sign. Time to beat some black people. They would show some black people getting beat by the cops <laughs> in the first 20 minutes of this movie. Oh. Minorities! Don't take me to Noob's house. That dilapidated experience of, of your house, bro. It's like di living in your, District 12. Your house has the structural integrity of your hairline. It's... It's weakness, bro. <laughs> She's thought of your hairline and screamed, bro. Cause Snow is kind of a lot more mysterious in the books. You, you really only see him through the perspective of Katniss, but... He's like a character in this, man. A fairy tale ending. This looked like a futuristic Jersey Shore. Oh nigga. my gosh. The situation. Nigga, you was on drugs. Oh, did he overdose? He overdosed. He loves his hero his heroines. That I'm hit. talking about female heroes. You know that heroine did not help him with the hair. Oh, we're gonna have to cut that. <laughs> we're going too savage. <laughs> 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 I'm sorry, this is just oh what we gosh. do. <laughs> I, I almost forgot. <laughs> we let it go. That we, <laughs> we let it go. That this is this is what we do. <laughs> you know when it's fireworks, I'm always like, man, this is a whole bunch of gunshots outside. You ever don't expect fireworks and you just hit the floor? Like you just chilling? <laughs> They're like, whoa. My neighborhood's so broke that they just use guns. So I'm always laying on the floor. His hairline looks like it could be fake as well, dude. I mean, it's looking quite 
Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> this movie would be a lot more uh, hard hitting if it was actual like teenagers, like teens that look like teens. Well, damn it, Jeremy! They took him to your house. That's the punishment that they do. Watch uh, the lovely bones with your father, like I did. <laughs> that was the most awkward experience in my life. This guy, he, he a weird guy. Only because he loved you. <laughs> it was a weird. Like experience. a mother who wasn't in the sun. <laughs> Jeez, they're just destroying all the cute as what we ain't for CDs. But next time, it's the firing squad. You know his wig would fly off. This dude is like a gym teacher. Anyone Remember our gym teacher in high school? That sounded fitness. He was a lot less threatening. Yeah, he yeah, was I mean, way more out of shape. Yeah, very t small trash cans he would destroy. He's like. <laughs> Remember he was mad at me because we had to uh, go do that like cross country, like you know, miles around the school, and I was just strolling, like I was, <laughs> I was just strolling, because he he did this whole long speech about you know the lowest record for this is thirty minutes, and that was a three hundred pound woman, and I was like I'm a I. I'm gonna break this record even longer. <laughs> and I was just going. I was just going. And he was like, fuck this. And I was like, no. Jesus. <laughs> Your favorite. You was looking through that Bible like, ooh! <laughs> <laughs> no. That came out the wrong way. You were reading that Bible and holding it with one hand, brother. Posted on the Patreon that we wouldn't be posting. Because we haven't posted in a while. Cause the homie passed, but yeah, rest in peace to the homie. See you later, cuz. To that denim. Reaped from the existing pool of victors. This is really good acting. I would be like, well, looks like Haymitch is going to the, <laughs> to the Hunger Games this year. She's really been rocking the vest this movie, a lot. Can you like volunteer as tribute every single year? <laughs> Nigga just does this for fun and games. It's just to get rich. She had a more of a pronounced unibrow in the first movie, and it bothered me. I didn't roast her for it, but uh. Dang! I might have to retroactively roast her for that. Oh yeah, weren't people shipping Effie and Haymitch? That alcoholic. They're both wearing wigs. Effie and Haymitch. What the frick is up with that girl's head? Whose design choice was to wrap it around? Looks like the people in the, the Lil Wayne Love Me music video. She don't want money. She want the time we could spend. Oh, isn't he a hoe? How'd we get here, huh? How'd we get here? He could have pulled off a vampire vampire diary. He could have. Uh, remember that when they were like, when Anakin and Padme were going out the tunnel? I thought we agreed not to fall in love. I love you. I thought that we had decided not to fall in love. Damn it, Jeremy! The prequel dialogue is burned into my mind <laughs> forever, dude. Oh, she's a fire! Fire! I would be so disturbed by this. Like this weird nigga. I'd have to throw the spear. Would you be disturbed if she was covered in Barney tattoos? I would be so out of shape though if I won the Hunger Games previously. Dude, you like. I'd be like, I am not training anymore. These are the niggas on shrooms. I would just start killing these people ahead of time. Kill all these people in their sleep. District 3, BD Latier. Report for individual assessment. They're gonna assess his hairline first. Peter, how are we gonna kill these people? Easily. Nigga, hey, you don't know any of these niggas. I'm killing them all. What? Nigga? Her skill is modern art. It'd be called like social creatures. His hair is getting more and more ridiculous. Special somebody. My mom. Those teeth are abnormally white. Yeah. They'll air uh, murders of children on TV, but they'll censor the cuss words. A wedding dress? Snow made me wear it. We'll make him pay for it. Yeah, send him the bill. What if it only catches on fire by twerking? Like, not twerking. <laughs> 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 yeah. It's like it. me. If I was white. Nah. Just uh, look up white crackhead. And then... <laughs> you know every crackhead is unique with every rock inside. This was my least favorite book to read. I'm only gonna break, 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 break your heart. What? Oh. We would die immediately, bro. <laughs> and we were like, we go, we got this. <laughs> and then the water, we're like, oh. <laughs> Watch his hairline be gone. He dead, man. 
He has not breathed for like a minute. Good dead, and like all his hair was in his hand. He's like, and he just jumps back. <laughs> I would like to see you in the trees one day. I can't climb a tree. I know you can't, but it's a dream I have. Man, I'm just imagining you doing like Undertaker moves on these old. Th I am not tombs. I am not putting a head between my crotch <laughs> and kneeling to the ground, dude. I ain't going out that way. I know you're gonna choke slam a. Oh, a grandma. Yeah, I would. What was that ride to hell where he gets the guy? This WWE moves be having too much face to crotch, dude. Ah, uh, she died. Grandma. Oh, grandma. That's the song. If it was just Mike Jones. You know, there could be a Hunger Games arena set in your house. That's a dangerous experience enough. I know, with the open nails that <laughs> you could fall into. All I can think about in this moment is Shrek clips. What? I've never, you know I've never seen these movies, brother. One day, I promise you. I'm not watching, no. I offered you a million dollars. You don't have a million dollars? I know. I've seen your house, I've seen your hairline. I know. Man, Peter, keep dying! Peter is the weakest I'm throwing man. him in that mist! It's so dark that I can't even see what's happening. I gave myself the shivers. And I just gave myself the shivers. It's so dark. I can't see anything that's happening. Those Ever chimp dogs? It's your family, brother. Oh my God. <laughs> it's a family reunion, bro. Our faces are all getting ripped off, dude. Especially other things. Dude, it's so dark. I literally, I just saw rolling and stabbing. I didn't know what was happening. <sighs> that is some death breathing, dude. Oh, jeez, that was quick. This is excessive. Jeez, what is the purpose? I would stay there. Would you just take the spins? Yeah. Oh, come on. It's a trap. Clearly a trap. If I hurt my sister, help me, awesome. No. <laughs> you would just hear chimp sounds. My family. No. <laughs> Nigga. Katniss is soft, bro. Nobody needs me. Chimp. Oh yeah, isn't she cutting the tracker out of the arm? This is still the weakest book in the... I like the Mockingjay most, but I always like the uh, finales a lot. Mockingjay probably won the two, you mean. I don't know why they split it. They do this to everything. They just want more money, so they split the last thing into two parts for some reason. Oh yeah, doesn't District 13 crash in? I know what to do now. My people need a hero. Oh! Gucci time! Man, you'd be getting up from this. <laughs> You'd be like, well, I have to dust it off, brother. This is weird. Imagine getting pulled up, and then you see like a giant me, <laughs> and then you realize you've been in a giant claw machine this yes. whole time. She picked up your heroin needles, bro. Might have been, might have been his. Good morning, <laughs> oh, fan fiction. And I swear that you don't have to go. This must be really like uh, on the edge of your seat for people who haven't read the books. Bow chicken, wow, wow, what you gonna say? I hated that song so much. Oh, yeah, anyway, thank you, the Patreon. Thank you. Oh, no Coldplay. We getting out of oh here. Oh, my God. But, uh, thank you.